ladies and entities to Les Bros Play Final Fantasy. I'm the Les, Chris. I'm the bro, Sean. Are you ready for the Final Fantasy VII Remake? I'm going to say yes, but I don't think that I actually am prepared so for So what do you know about Final Fantasy VII? Nothing. Okay. There's a guy with a giant sword and you like this game. There you go. So Final <laughs> Fantasy VII, before we get there, my little bit of knowledge on it is, was Final Fantasy, the original came out because a company called Squaresoft at the time was going bankrupt. Okay. And they said they put all that they had left into one final project and they called it their Final Fantasy. Okay. And so the first Final Fantasy came out on the, I believe it was the Famicom, so the original Nintendo. Okay. Then they made Buku Bucks and made six more on the Nintendo slash Super Nintendo system. Final Fantasy VII was supposed to come out on the Super Nintendo and they got about I want to say a quarter to a halfway done with it kind of thing like that at the time when they realized, wow, this may be a little ambitious for the Super Nintendo. So they transferred over, as Sony was bringing out their new system, the PlayStation. And so it was basically the big... I don't, I don't know if it came out at launch. I'm not 100% sure on the, the launch on it. But it came out very early in the PlayStation cycle. Uh, so much so that I'm pretty sure the PlayStation controller didn't have uh, uh, joysticks yet. Oh. The original PlayStation 4 didn't have joysticks, so we're just okay. just all about. It. So it came out on that, and it is ambitious and huge and very interesting. Uh, but the graphics also were kind of in between. It wasn't at what the PlayStation really could do because a lot of it was coded for the Super Nintendo originally, right. uh, and it blew everyone away, and everyone loved it. Now, fast forward. Aren't there like 15 of these games? There are 15 just straightforward Final Fantasies. There's probably 50 just Final Fantasy games that exist. Jesus. Yeah. Uh, from one game that's supposed to be the end. Uh, that is there. Uh, so fast forward 10 years, approximately. Uh, the PS3 is being debuted at E3. And the PlayStation 3, with its high capability graphics, to show it off, they basically did a tech demo of the opening scene of Final Fantasy, but in... Graph Final Fantasy VII in, gra in this new graphics. And everyone was just like, Oh my gosh! We need this! Fast forward ten years later, when finally at E3, they announced that this long-rumored game was happening. That was in 2015. <laughs> Five years later, we are finally playing Final Fantasy VII Remake. Now, the fun thing about this game is this is the first, this game is approximately clocks in about 50 hours. I've played about six of it already uh, on my own time. It clocks in about 50 hours. This is of the first three hours of the original game. Okay. That is, they do the first section of the game, the first tiny section of the game, and they expanded it out. So they have expanded the universe. All right. So get ready. You're going to learn a lot about Final Fantasy VII. All There's also a movie that came out that's a sequel, Final Fantasy Advent Children. So this is basically an even updated version of what they showed as the tech demo for the PlayStation 3. Okay. Are there lesbians though? That's the important question. In every Final Fantasy game, everyone is bisexual. Okay. <laughs> you know I'm down. You know I'm down. Everyone might swing another way. <laughs> Valid. Eagle. That's you in bird form. Eagle. Oh, okay. Cool. I'm majestic. <laughs> the majestic bird. I'm flying through fog, though. How am I not dying? So the original a game smoke. is a lot of... The effect of corporations on the uh, environment is the original game. Okay. This one's going to ratchet that up even more. Okay. Our first mission might be blowing up a reactor. Oh, fuck yeah. Yeah. 
it might be that reactor. <laughs> and what's great about this game is it takes a lot of the lore and it really expands upon it. Because there's a lot of stuff in the original game that you just kind of have to expand in your own mind or decide from it because they don't, they don't go into a ton of details, not to mention the dialogue slash a lot of the game hasn't aged well. Okay. I love her jacket. She's pretty. Become very attached to her. I okay. love her. Is that a command or are you telling me I'm going to? You might. Okay. We're not going to get to her for a little while. We'll see, uh, her. We'll see her for a, a little bit. But. Look at that outfit. She's an icon, obviously. Yep. And the theme song you're hearing, which is a piece of One Winged Angel, which is one of the most famous pieces of video game music of all time. Okay. Written by the great Nobuo Uematsu. Sir, that is so rude. Would you step on her flowers? No. Good. She's obviously picking them up. I would help her. What if you were carrying a box and couldn't see? Like that dude. Oh, well, then I'd probably feel myself stepping upon it and immediately apologize. Hmm. You can feel flowers underneath your feet? Yeah. Impressive. Because there's a difference between walking on pure sidewalk like he was and then walking on a flower all of a sudden. And you can feel that underneath your feet. Are, are, are you ready to meet the love of my life? Okay, Who yeah. I didn't know was the love of my life until I started playing this game. Okay. I'm down. I love the music of this game so much. Ooh, cool. <laughs> Maka Reactor One. I like the Shinra Soldier model. I've always been interesting the helmet. <laughs> Even if I'm not sure what the three things are, if they're hidden cameras. No. Maybe one's a camera, maybe the other two are like the Love of my life! Okay, that's badass as hell. I <laughs> love her too. Ma'am, you're doing great. I'm so proud of you. Hello, sir. That's Barrett. The man with the machine gun arm. You are a giant. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> that was a great way to introduce the character. So in the original game, it was a turn-based RPG. They've caught, they've made it much more action RPG with some turn-based elements to it. Ah, uh, what does that mean? It means basically every time you attack, it's every people take turns to attack. Oh, okay. Sweet. But that's not this game. This game's more of an action RPG with elements to it. I've now beaten this mission multiple times because I played on my own playthrough. I played the demo as well as played the original game. So. Have fun. Oh, I love She's you. She's so pretty. Wow. I love her. <laughs> She's ditching guys and Sean and I are just like, oh, love of my life. Uh, there's a mission later on where basically she, she gets you to come on and help her. Oh, yeah, I'm uh, done. And she is just all over you. She is throwing herself at oh you. Oh my god, <laughs> we're just going to watch me die. She, she is just big, because you're riding a motorcycle, and there's Holy motorcycle fuck. things, yeah. She got a motorcycle. Oh. She's, you're driving the motorcycle, she's holding on to you. Fuck. <laughs> Christina's fantasy. Yeah. Is it your final fantasy? <laughs> Well, I would hope I wouldn't die doing it. <laughs> like, Big Wedge and Jesse were in the old game, but man, they are, um... They are so expanded on so far in this game that it's just like, it's awesome to see side characters really fleshed out. Yeah. 
Um, there's not a lot of strategy that goes into fighting these. There's a, there'll be a lot of strategy in bosses, the boss coming up, but... Early hack and slash. Fair. I know how to do things. I know how to open boxes. Look at me, I got two potions. Woohoo! I feel like there's something... Yeah. Collecting potions is good. Because... Death happens. Valid. Okay, I don't think there's anything else in there. There's some down here, that's right. Alright, we're gonna get to talk to the love of my life. Okay, love her. Well, first we gotta... We gotta talk to, to, to Wedge first. Love of my life! So what soldier boys deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls, this, uh... Uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. Is that us? Yes. Or Cloud. That's big. So, he's a professional. Unlike the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. Thank you, Biggs. So, this is a one-time. Tetsuya Numoro, who helped make the story, as well as the creator of Kingdom Hearts, is a humongous Star Wars fan. Okay. And back in the day, he helped with the original Final Fantasy VII. And from that, there's a running uh, thing that goes on in the games. Is there's almost always a Biggs and a Wedge Star Wars names. Okay. Also, in basically every Final Fantasy, there's somebody named Sid. Which we met Sid from Final Fantasy VII and Kingdom Hearts, and we played it on our stream. Ah. What else am I cloud to? I don't remember meeting Cloud. I remember meeting Leon though. Uh, cloud was in Hercules. Come on, nobody do something this crazy just for money. <laughs> you think? I think? You're a true believer, but you know what I think. Not interested. Uh, <laughs> sir, the kid, the kid just wants to talk to you. I love Barry. Fuck, he's so fucking huge. He's a large man. Yeah. He's got muscles galore. His forearm is bigger than my entire body. You better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. Promise I am. <laughs> I am a me, yes! I am! <laughs> Don't hurt me! And this is the iconic shot. That was the cover of the game. I know. Sorry, I have to kill a dog. I apologize, Christine, I have to kill a dog. Stagger? And the dog is harder to kill than the person. Oh, yeah, they, well, you have to stagger them. Um. So, fun, uh, a. Uh, way in this game is if you. Uh, uh, some people, some creatures and people have harder, higher defense, and to get them down, you have to stagger them so they aren't. they basically their shields are down more or less. Okay. There. Dun, 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 dun. I have time to bottle of ether. Oh, you're gonna come get me? Okay. You have two different modes of attacking, your regular road and that mode, and then this is your uh, Punisher mode. Okay. Where you're... Less, less movement, but... Okay, Wedge, thank you, I love you. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Going up the elevator. The only thing is, I like. I feel like I should be in an action adventure game, so I want to jump, and you don't have a jump button in this game. So. Oh, weird. So, well, none of the old games had jump buttons. I think the first one that actually had a jump button was Final Fantasy X-2, I believe. All right. Okay. Let me let me go through. Okay. Not so fast. We got company. Sigsen's cool. He thinks he's cool, but he is cool. So. <laughs> but he is cool. Oh, what the fuck is up with that dog? He's a guard dog. Um, it's got a tail coming from its head. That is an alien. Do you not have a tail coming from your head? I mean, I might, but that's a different discussion.
taking a lot of damage from behind, but <laughs> I decided to go after the dog instead of the people first. Fair enough. Get rid of the weird alien dog. It's okay, alien dog. I still love you, even if you Why? were weird. up to the love of my life, will you? I'm trying to! <laughs> we want to ride motorcycles with her. We oh, do! Hi. of this game is off. There are four dudes and one girl. Oh, that seems worry. unrealistic. Don't worry. The, the women will come. Okay. We're a terrorist organization, so it's okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Soldiers may attack on command. Eco-terrorists, though. Baron doesn't seem to like us much. Well, so how do we, get to the we were a part of Soldier, which is basically Shinra, the corporation government ruling bodies, Attack force. And we're fighting Shinra right now, so. She doesn't trust us. You can't do it without me. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this. But I'll manage. Should we go talk to our love of our life? Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. Okay, love you. <laughs> I love you! <laughs> Alright, what do you want, Biggs? I will trust you. Damn. <laughs> Biggs is a little cocky. I know. But I'm, I'm down. I like him. He seems cool. That's my life. Alright, Cloud. <laughs> I want to cosplay Cloud. He's cool. You could probably cosplay Cloud. Basically, any it, it look. It sounds like you know, to date us a little bit here. It sounds like any um uh any uh Comic Con that takes place in the summer will be canceled anywhere it is. Yeah. Just to date us a little bit. So if anybody watching this. Far in the future. In like two years from now, and they're like, oh yeah, that pandemic. <laughs> Hopefully it'll Where be Where either we all died or we all lived. <laughs> Hopefully we're still alive. Love my life. It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcodes. It is a good thing I well, love you. Know You're me. so useful. <laughs> <laughs> know me. <laughs> I love you. I love you. <laughs> Sean. <laughs> Welcome to Lesbros Play Games where we don't and love, fall in love with characters. <laughs> This is the plus side of watching a lesbian and a straight person play. We just, we're both in love too easily with video game characters. Uh, You make it sound like I just made a shit ton of mistakes. You know, sometimes I make mistakes. Oh, I got She has to push the button. We gotta do it for the love of We gotta do it together. I'll do anything with you. So, you know Tifa, right? Yes, I know Tifa. Is she hitting on us? Yes. Please be hitting on us. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Jesse is Yay. hitting on us through so much of the game. Oh, I love her. You have not played Final Fantasy, so this doesn't make sense. Just keep nope. this in your mind. Okay. <laughs> We're in a wasteland. Oh, this must be when we were kids. I'm going to very much enjoy playing through the twists with you, Christina. Okay. Because there are a lot of twists in this game. Okay. Not necessarily in this one, because we're not going to get to that till Final Fantasy VII Remake 2 or 3 or 4, however many they make of these. So you see on the back of the sword the little green thing? Okay. That is uh, how they do magic. It's called Materia. 
Uh, and you can actually see it in your weapons in this game. Ah, the bad guys. The Shinra Corporation, Corporation run by President Shinra. Mm -hmm. These sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche Sir. Oh, oh man. As played by uh, John DiMaggio. Who, uh, he is the voice of Bender from Futurama. I haven't watched it. The voice of Marcus Phoenix from Gears of War. I haven't played The voice of Waka from Final Fantasy X. Cat. The voice of Jake the Dog from Adventure Time. Know that. <laughs> Love the random rant. I love you. We become vampires. I don't know, but I'm I'm digging your energy. Damn. He's like the he's like the coach in the basketball game. He's like. <laughs> wants to play this game! He's actually like, you know, with like fourth graders and they're just like, oh, why? I'm digging your energy, dude. I'll, I'll follow you. We're good. Ah, <laughs> uh, we're gonna get to play as Barrett now. I love your multiple belts. <laughs> Take me with you. <laughs> love me. Just bear with him for me, would you? Yes! Yes! for you! <laughs> should have asked for more money. I love the characters in this game. <laughs> Into us, and I'm into her. Barrett Wallace has joined the team. Cool! Let's go, Barrett! Okay. Yes, I know how to do it. I just literally did the thing. Thanks for your help, Cloud. I mean, he's got a sword. What can he do? He has a fire. Oh. Well, I guess he can use that thing. Cloud. Uh, oh, you don't have ATV. Never mind. Oh, John, he could have. You see that little gauge below it? Below it to do. Woo! Cloud, do things. Cloud, do things. I think he is. Okay. Good. Yeah, he's doing things. I should really like playing the Barrett, but no time to celebrate. I'll do a lot of that in the boss here coming up. You said you do or you don't? Oh, I love playing as Barrett. Oh, okay. I just said, uh, in my playthrough, my, my own, I haven't gotten too far, but I've been able to play as Barrett, Cloud, and Tifa. Okay. Yep. Be careful, my love. You're amazing. You will do! <laughs> I'll never take my eye off you ever. <laughs> She's not out of our eyesight. Thank you, ma'am. I love you. Love you. Okay. <laughs> Whatever you want. These ones are a little faster. Oh, barely. I got Nick to on them. 
I think Barrett got hit like four times, but. <laughs> Follow Jesse is my objective. Bow. Dun, dun. finish this mission here next time when Lesbros play Final Fantasy 7 Remake.